not in that office, you can ignore that. Okay. Let's at least go talk to that guy downstairs then. United in their cause to find a common ground. No, no traffic. Most of the streets are blocked out. Are you deaf or just plain stupid? I told you I had to get the hell out of my way. Strong words. You're a real poet. Tell me. Is that how you plan to handle the judge when they prosecute you for perjury, possession, and intent to distribute? What the hell are you babbling about, Chrome Boy? Funny story. There's this guy, Blaine Lopez. Deals dope near City Airport. A real scumbag. You know him? Because I have a nice little chat record between him and you. So you want to go to jail? Or you want to tell me what I want to know? How the it's hell do you... Shit, man. Now listen. I just did what was asked of me. I, I didn't have a choice. Talk. Okay. You have the worst haircut I ever. I just came of in one morning, in and world. there was an email with my new <laughs> assignment in it. Official business, but there were also specific instructions. I had to check out the lab for footage from an IntelliCam. They told me to take it and leave it near a garbage can somewhere near the lake. What was on it? Well, it's not crystal clear, but. Mainly, it shows the boys who attacked Seraph as they were breaching the labs. And it looked like they were bringing something in with them. Eh, impossible to tell what. Who asked you to do this? You think I know? Orders are orders around here. They always come from above. And nobody asks questions. You just do what they say, and you hope you don't end up like Secretary Haas over there. Damn. I'd okay, so that, like, puts... Um, get out of here. Get, get out of here. Okay. So I need to investigate his computer and I need to locate the storage unit. Um, let's make this one active. David Sarah, in person. Don't you just down there? How do I do the storage unit? Maybe if it has to be outside, then maybe we can do that when we go. Um, move, please. I'm. You're an official business. Um, where's the downstairs? Um, move the map. Central stairwell. Second Avenue. So we're seeing our dollar to the lobby. Remember that shipment we just got in? See you. Let's go down to the morgue and steal this guy's his aug. Is the alarm is gonna go off? Yeah, about time. You the home sec guy I was ordered to wait for? Tell Manderly I didn't get the memo until I was halfway through the autopsy. By then, it was too late to close him up again. Right. So you recovered the neural hub? Tricky bit of work that was. A few inches lower and the bullet would have fried more than just the pedal connectors. As it is, I can't guarantee you'll get anything useful out of it, other than the fact that it's been modified. Modified? With what? Some kind of wet drive. But hey, I didn't look. Ultraviolet means ultraviolet, and I know how touchy you guys get when it comes to matters of national security. Yeah. It's all yours. The hub's been detached, but I left it in the skull, as ordered. Now, if you'll excuse me, I got paperwork to fix. You just leave. I mean, this guy looks fucked up. Boss, I got the neural hub. Looks like it's been modified with some kind of wet drive. Pritchard should have a look at it. No, don't bring it here. Frank's not finished running his diagnostic, and I don't want to risk connecting any tech to our networks till he's done. Especially if the tech is military. So what do you want me to do? <laughs> Take the hub to your apartment. I'll have Frank contact you there. Use my home computer to analyze the hub. Okay. Cloud in there. Damn. Um. Yeah, I don't have 
have a hacking ability. Before we go to my apartment, let's check out the security locker thing. The evidence locker. Except I don't know how to freaking get to it. It's over here. So I need to go around this way. Can I get through this gate? It's definitely over there. Looks like I go all the way around. Damn, every time that happens, I think it's like a plane flying like 20 feet over my head. Alright. Sprint, fool. What's with all the fucking punk goth rocker people? Oh. Um. How? Oh damn, I have like no energy. Okay. I'm gonna use one of those things for... Okay, I'm full of energy. Except I have no idea how to get through this thing. Something. Fucking gunshots. Um. What are you guys freaking out about? There's nothing going on. It's all good. It's all good. Oh. Oh, hello. You don't see me, do you? How does he not see me? What the hell is going on here? No, no, no. Nothing's going on. Just close you. <laughs> what? They're shooting at me? Freaked out. Oh, she's freaked out. Damn. That was crazy. So, like, I alerted those guys, and then they freaked out, and then the cops were like, uh, no, you can't do that. Danger high voltage. Alright, let's see if we can find another one of those. Those, uh, fire escapes or some shit. Everyone's freaked out because there was a big gunfight just now. Okay. Um, update. Too heavy. According to Chase, all the evidence that the investigation moved to the cold case storage locker after the fence took over the case. I need to find that locker and take a look. Can I, like, um, I thought I could pick heavy stuff up. Oh, holster the gun. If I, like, used energy. Update. Let's keep saying update. Media log. Nope. Um. Screaming outside my window. Okay, going down. So I can get down 
somewhere over here, it looks like. So let's try that. sewer entrance I can climb in or something. I don't know how the hell else I would get down underneath. Let's see. Oh, here we go. Manhole cover. Whoa. Down we go into the sewers. I want to shoot some shit. Lots of people down here. Oh, everything's all. Why is everything all electrical? Don't come no closer, Slick. Back off. Why? That. How about I do that? So fuck you. Oh. Turn around, Hog. This doesn't concern you. Oh, he definitely saw me. I want to... I need to get over there. I don't want, like, the people... Must have been a shadow or something. Um... Okay, if I want to get to the other side... Don't get involved in this, asshole! Get out of here! Don't get involved in this asshole. Get out of here. Shotgun. I just picked that up. Yeah. Glad I didn't buy one then. Wait, where's the shotgun? Run out of room in my inventory. I need to I need to upgrade that shit. Okay. So let's look at our map again. We basically need to get all the way through all this, it looks like. Um unless we should go up here. It looks like right under the police station, so let's not do that. Um, what's this? Oh. Probably would have been a way for me to skip those guys. Oh, hello. Wait, are these just hobos? Talk. Does it give me an option to talk to hobos? Why don't you take a picture, asshole? Okie dokie. We'll just keep on walking then. Is this a spot? Yes. say open up bitch but then I for some reason wanted to say open sesame oh that's probably our money shot Oop. Nope, get out of here. I don't know why I'm reading all these um okay what did that update was that it oh but there's something in this box 
a hack vest or is it security level two? Uh, Bet's goodies. Okay. I know I should probably be reading those things, but it's just a side quest, man. Like, whatever. Is this that electrical bullshit? Can I shut it off? Apparently not. Okay, how do I get back to like the main area? I don't want to have to go through the sewer again. Can I go up this thing? Climb it. Why can't I? <laughs> oh, I am on the wrong side. Um. No. Oh God. Well, there goes the concussion grenade I had. <laughs> Damn it! Uh, I'm retarded. Let's move stuff over. Okay, I don't have any ammo for that gun. Same for that one. I wish there was a way that I could like hold shift and just like slide down the ladder, like in most other games. Sup, hobos. Oh, I almost just fell in the water. I can hear the little rats running around. Is there anything back here? No. I don't know why I'm so interested in exploring the sewers. Dude, you look... you are in bad shape. Anyone need a free couch? I like how I just leave this open, like, you think you would shut it behind you. Okay, I need to get to my apartment. Um, let's see. That's... I need the second level of data for that. So my apartment would go this way, right? Up around, yeah. Sprint. 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 <laughs> Jump on cars. Sprint. Hey, Jackson. Oh, damn. Oh, I've seen you before, huh? It's just something about a man who's augmented. <laughs> oh. Oh, I. this is actually Jensen. a cutscene. Okay. Thank God, it's been a while. Remember me? We used to work the old 17th precinct back in the day. <laughs> I wish I could go with the good old you haven't changed at all bit, but that'd be complete and utter bullshit, right? <laughs> oh, we can be flirty. Yeah, I guess that's one way to put it. I like your new style. A bit revealing for my taste, but not entirely unappealing. <laughs> oh, yeah? <laughs> well, don't get your hopes up, big boy. I'm undercover, keeping tabs on derelict rowballers. I've got to hunch something big's coming. Oh. Why do I get the sudden feeling you're about to include me into that something big? Because you're clever. That and the fact that, well, it's pretty obvious. But jokes aside, you couldn't have come at a better time, Jensen. This case I'm on, we're stalling and we could use a little external help. Go ahead. I'm with IA now, and we're working a sting on a dirty cop named Jack O'Malley. Elusive, motherfucker. I mean, men in black elusive. We know he's involved in drugs, weapon dealing, tied into the gangs. But he's clever, and we just can't seem to pin anything on him. I swear he's got friends in high places. Okay, and where do I fit in all this? You're an outsider. You can go places we legally can't. I need someone to do a couple of things. Alrighty. Break into his apartment, sneak into DRB territory, and finally, go undercover posing as a hitman. This oh, guy's nothing minor, Jensen. He's the real deal. Major player, major consequences. 
We have to get him before shit hits a fan. You in? Hmm. I mean, I can always deactivate it. Why not? Can't let a guy like that roam free. I'm in. All right, then. Let's get to work. Like I said, I've got a couple of very promising leads, but O'Malley's got friends among the powers that be. I wouldn't be able to get my hands on a warrant even if I had footage of the perp confessing in real time as he's finger-painting his motive on the wall in the victim's blood. So I guess we're going to have to break a few rules. That's a specific analogy. Mm, yeah. Suits me. Rules would only slow me down. Hmm. Very Dirty Harry of you, Jensen. Do you find Dirty Harry But sexy? we still have to be careful how we handle this. <laughs> We've worked hard to catch this son of a bitch. I don't want him to walk on a technicality. Fair enough. Um... Okay. What's this about getting into DRB territory? Yeah, I needed to get in there and track down a shipment of weapons for me. We managed to gain access to solid information that will tie it to O'Malley, but... I need proof it's really there. They've probably stashed it around somewhere. A cop dealing weapons to a criminal anti og gang? Not a pretty picture. Got that right. I guess we both agree. Nothing good can come out of this, huh? I don't know where exactly the DRB's cash is, but I know there's a bonus for you if you manage to sneak in and out without being spotted. Would make shit easier to handle on my side. Alrighty. So what am I looking for in O'Malley's apartment? Information, drugs, weapons. Basically, anything you think can be used to build a stronger case against him. The more you get, the better. What about the undercover assignment? Posing as a hitman. O'Malley's crafty, and even a bit paranoid. He's always using proxies, scapegoats, and red herrings to get us off his ass. But after months of schmoozing, <laughs> we finally got through to one of his guys. Turned him into a mole. He provides us with information, stuff like that. And he's gonna be my way in? Exactly. Yesterday, another one of O'Malley's guys whacked someone, a drug dealer. There's a witness, but we don't have any details. O'Malley does, and he wants someone to take care of the mess. The usual guy just got busted for possession, so the contact will send you in to pose as his replacement. Hmm. O'Malley will be waiting for you in an alley next to the police station. Sounds and you want like me to milk him mission. to get the info on the witness? You haven't lost your touch, Jensen. We think O'Malley will ask you to retrieve the murder weapon, use it to kill the witness, and then plant it on a scapegoat he can arrest later. What you need to do is get that weapon and bring it to me. And what about the witness? We're almost positive he's a member of the MCBs. Once you know the location, you'll need to get there, take care of any opposition, and prep him for retrieval. Prep him? Well, you know, he's a gangbanger, Jensen. He's not going to turn in peacefully, but we what need him alive. What are you doing alive. with your hands, Chick? So I guess you're going to have to play this one macho and knock him out. One of our guys will then just happen to stumble upon him, you know. Serendipity. Okay, let's do this. You can contact me on my info link if anything comes up. Excellent. Oh, and Jensen, one last thing. To protect my cover, it'd be better if you only contact me again once you've taken care of everything. To protect your cover. Oh, she smokes. No, and she does too. Uh, none of them are sexy anymore. Look at the equipment you've got. Woo! Why not give me a little demo? <laughs> You know, I had a friend who once said video games, video game boobs just don't do it for me. Um, and my response was, well, what the hell is the difference between video game boobs and fake boobs? <laughs> so, oh yeah, that, that's your word of wisdom for the day. Oh damn, we got lots of blue X's. Let's, um, let's get rid of those for now. So not in our face. Where are you, Jensen? I haven't got all night. Don't you shut the fuck Hello, up, Richard. I'm almost in my apartment now. Well, when you do get in there, connect the neural hub to your computer. I've created a secure tunnel, and I'll take over remotely. You can access my personal computer. Who do you think configured your security protocols? Mm, this guy. Welcome home, Mr. Jensen. Oh. Oh. So this is my apartment, huh? Nice bed. Oh, someone was angry. What's that say? Call. Can't. Call landlord. Replace me here again. 
Okay, that's kind of funny. Um, why do I have a big box in there that I can pick up and throw? What the hell is that? That's a big ass TV. Damn. I want a TV that big. Oh. Hello, weapon ammo. Can I. Clock building? Huh. No. Get out of here. Kitchen. Oh man. You kind of live like a slob, bro. Oh, this is like the newspaper. Oh, that's kind of neat. Uh, get out of here, though. Okay. Let's do this computer thing. Nope. We've got a, rend a CG rendered cutscene now. Pritchard, the hub's connected. I know. Now be quiet and let me concentrate. I need his name, Pritchard, not his entire genetic history. That's not his DNA. It's the data he was trying to steal from us before he... My God, Jensen. Your suicide hacker didn't kill himself. You obviously didn't see his brain spidered all over the floor. No, no, you don't understand. The wet drive modification in this chip, it allows someone to hack through you. It turns you quite literally into a human proxy. So he wasn't working alone. Someone off-site was doing the actual hacking. Exactly. And whoever it was tried to hide his location by using multiple satellites. But I may have just traced him to here. An abandoned factory complex in Highland Park. Get me the address, Pritchard. Because if we're lucky, whoever pulled our terrorist strings might still be there. Meanwhile, I've been wasting all this time doing a bunch of other stuff. When Megan died, nobody knew what to do with Kubrick, so I took him in, but I couldn't keep him, and nobody knew if he'd wake up, so I didn't know what else to do. I'm really sorry, he was a sweet dog. Like, what? Like, he's dead? Oh. In respect to your latest reminder to have the mirror in your bathroom replaced, may I remind you once again that this item is on back order. The situation is out of your hands and no minor pestering will make it arrive any sooner. And while on the subject, we are still unclear as to how, you, how precisely this mirror came to be damaged. Perhaps you can enlighten us? <laughs> <clears throat> um, quick donor, you repair man if you need anything. You notice there's a hidey hole of sorts built in the wall of code for it is 5375. Um, wait, what? So that's in somewhere in my apartment there's a hidey hole? Adam, it's David. Let me guess. You're sending me to Highland Park. Not just yet. Frank's figured out why the network's been compromised. There's a persistent transmission coming from Derelict Row. Street gang territory. Well, our dead friend was posing as an Antioch. Who better to hide with than the d row ballers? Right. I'm on my way. Where's this hidey hole thing? Where I can put in a key code combination. Is this? Yep. Secret stash. Open it. Open. Oh. Open, I see. Mm -hmm. Wait, 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 no, I said open. Open. Behind the TV, that's legit. Oh, damn. Special upgrade, pistol armor piercing system. What? Um, isn't that like a one-time use thing? Is there anything on this upper level? Nope. Um, okay. How do I drop something out of my inventory? Can I, like, drop the shotgun? Okay. Now we take that and armor piercing system. Wait. Examine. Okay. Combine with the pistol. 
Oh, that's sweet. Okay, now we can pick up our shotgun again. Awesome. Cooler pistol! Huh? What's up, janitor? Mr. Jensen, I fixed up your apartment real nice. That special request you asked for works like a charm. Did he mean my Welcome secret stash? Home, Mr. Jensen. In which case, I need to close that. All right, see a biatch. Come on, go, 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 go. Reestablishing security system. Do I have anything? Um, I only have that one energy jar. I guess I can go buy more, but hide that, hide it, hide it, hide it. I do know that we could go to, we could go to that place, buy a couple of those Praxis things, since we have a bunch Jensen, of credits. I'd appreciate it if you instructed your street informants to use more conventional means of contacting you. What are you talking about, Richard? I mean, I found a message stapled to your door. Colo, alley off Bagley Avenue, Ezekiel. How cryptic. Uh -uh. That's their Seraph HQ. I'll look into it. Oh, and it's Cholo. <laughs> oh, and it's Cholo. Um, we could go to that limb clinic and get some um, augmented, or get them Praxis things and unlock the security thing and wrap up the stupid police station thing. What's with all the hookers in this town? I think they're kind of cool. Yeah, to me, it's a well. <laughs> nah. I don't do no tricks with no ogs, yo. What? Yeah, to me, it's a welcome chick. You want to have some fun tonight, sexy? Because I haven't had a cutie like you in a long time. Oh. Yeah, to me, it's a... Hey, sweetie, damn you cute. Yeah, damn to you me, cute. it's a welcome change to the dirty... Talk to these two. They might be able to help you out. You know what? Yeah, to me, it's You're a, a hooker. Hey, big dirty boy. Old you can't judge me for being augmented. Oh, and here's our lady friend. Let's leave her there. What's this? Why would you book me a trick inside the room? This DRB turf, asshole. Don't try it. Whatever that means. What's the deal, baby? Nissan? Don't worry, oh, baby. Hello there. Okay. Alright. I'm gonna take a short break, grab a drink of water. Um, we'll do this, the main mission here next, and then we'll come back and we'll side quests. A couple of side quests, I think. Uh, okay, I'll be right back.